There is no way Mike Alexander is going to stay on my show. I want you to skewer him. Make him look like a complete idiot. Not that it'll be hard. The man is a moron of unseen proportions. Larry, listen to me. I want Mike Alexander to go down in flames. I want Mike Alexander to be nothing but a pile of ash on the seat next to you. I want the janitor to come in with his dust buster and vacuum up the ashes of Mike Alexander. And then when he throws the ashes into the dumpster outside, I want the rats to vomit and then defecate on the ashes of Mike Alexander. Okay, first off, a lion swimming in the ocean? Lions don't like water. If you'd placed it near a river or some sort of fresh water source, that, that'd make sense. But you find yourself in the ocean, 20 foot wave. I'm assuming it's off the coast of South Africa, coming up against a fully grown 800 pound tuna with his 20 or 30 friends. You, you lose that battle. You lose that battle nine times out of 10. And guess what? You've wandered into our school of tuna and we now have a taste of lion. We've talked to ourselves. We've communicated and said, you know what? Lion tastes good. Let's go get some more lion. We've developed a system to establish a beachhead and aggressively hunt you and your family. And we will corner your pride, your children, your offspring, we will construct a series of breathing apparatuses with kelp. We will be able to trap certain amounts of oxygen. It's not gonna be days at a time, an hour, hour 45 perhaps, no problem. That'll give us enough time to figure out where you live, go back to the sea, get more oxygen and then stalk you. You just lost at your own game. You're outgunned and outmanned. Did that go you way you thought it was? Ugh. Did that go the way you thought it was gonna go? Nope. Holy testicle Tuesday. I came to confess. I was the second gunman on the greasy knoll. Cut, <sighs> it's grassy knoll. Sorry. Oh, thank you. Sorry, have I been saying greasy? It sounded like greasy this time. <laughs> yeah, probably. Yeah, okay. Right. Sorry, sorry, sorry. No and five, four, three, two, action. One, two, three. Holy testicle Tuesday. I came to confess. I was the second gunman on the grassy knoll. Whew. Now I feel much better. Of course, that might not do any good. You see, nobody's missing a porpoise. It's a dolphin that's been taken. The common harbor porpoise has an abrupt snout, pointed teeth, and a triangular thoracic fin. While the bottlenose dolphin has, or Terceops truncatus, has an elongated beak, round cone-shaped teeth, and a distinctive serrated dorsal appendage. But I'm sure you already knew that. That's what turns me on about you, actually. Hey, maybe I'll give you a call sometime, Lieutenant. Your number's still 911, right? <laughs>